We're staying in a slightly seedy hotel down here at the Gold Coast and they have this creepy room with a table and balloons down there. And you can't get anywhere in it. So I'm not quite sure what that's all about. Also the fact that we're in the basement, that's cool. About to give you guys a tour of the room though. You're gonna love it. This is uh this is where you lock the door. Obviously fresh coat of paint. Um, this is where you don't vacuum. Um, got these. Got a lot of beds. Because you know it's good to have choices. Under no circumstances there to be cooking or smoking in the rooms. The fire alarms are activated. You will be charged $900 management. Serious fucking note there. Um, bathroom. It's doing good. Light rust, but no big deal. It just seems to me like putting a crack around the top of the bathroom is like prime breeding grounds for humongous Australian spiders. But maybe that's just me. We do have a back porch though. All right, so this is our dank patio. Um, only a few blood stains on the wall, so that's cool. We got a view that you can't see right now, but I'm sure it's beautiful. Also, don't roll off your pillow because you'll ding your head on the corner of this very well-placed switch. Um, and last but not least, there's some schmoo. Um, it doesn't come with a cover on the light. Anywho, if you guys want to check out the website, this place is called the Hinterland Hotel and they totally suckered us in with wonderful pictures. Although, I did get a scotch when I checked in. Yep, looks great, huh? Man, beautiful rooms, beautiful paint, beautiful colors. What the shit, Lana? Survived the night. Didn't hit my head on that thing, so I consider that to be a great success. We only had to kill two beetles that were crawling on the wife's feet. And strangely enough, that view that I was telling you about is actually nice. We're right by a river. I did not see that. Well, coming out of the hidey hole dungeon we were in to leave this morning. And apparently this place ain't too bad, because, you know, the Maz.
Didn't you always kind of find the female Bugs Bunny kind of attractive? Thanks, Garth, for that amazing line. And yes, yes we did. Successful day at the theme park. Babe got to ride her roller coasters. And they were real good, and there was no lines, so bonus. Now we're gonna try to hit the beach for a few hours and head back up to Brisbane. five roller coasters that I've ever been on. The Joker up there. I mean it's it's a good ways up. And then you basically just go straight down. And then right back up. Good day at the amusement park. Pumped, we got to go. And most of the rides we get to ride twice. You can't beat that for 70 bucks. Not bad. We got up at five o'clock in the morning and now we are in Sydney. Hot dang. It's definitely colder than Brisbane was and has been raining on and off. Lovely. And now we're chilling at a beach in Melbourne. A little different vibe here. Less of a south beach and more of a south lake. But that's okay. Haven't touched the water yet, but I bet it's not super warm. Question mark? But yeah. Beach time again. The day before we leave. Gonna attempt to go in the water. It is cold as a mother. Plus the sand has lots of rocks and stuff in it. So that's cool. I uh, left my wallet in my pants, so that's moist. I fall asleep for like two minutes. That's what I'm dealing with right now. Hey, this is Officer Dan and I'm in Australia. You are, mate, but we need to fix some things. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What? Nothing. I feel like a... Uh, Australian. All right, now that I'm feeling fully awkward, I need to learn how to throw a boomerang. So we don't have any kangaroos local or at the beach, but we do have real kangaroo balls. <laughs> okay, step one complete. Next. Step one. He he looks a little bit, a little bit hungry. Vegemite. <laughs> That tastes like that nutsack smells. He's eating. Oh. He's he's ready. He's just a little bit thirsty now. 
Victoria better? What could wash it down better? Wait for me. I need a beer. Wait for me. I need a beer. Oh, he's on a beer. We did not do that together at all. <laughs> Are you gonna have any beer with your beer? We're ready for the boomerang. <laughs> okay, so I just chuck it. So this boomerang is guaranteed to return if thrown correctly. He doesn't know how to throw it yet. I'm going to teach him that. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just passing it. Yeah. Side around the other, hold the boomerang flat side to palm with end about the middle of the palm. Face the direction from which the wind is blowing. Now turn at an angle of about 45 degrees to the right of the wind direction and raising the boomerang above right shoulder, slightly tilt of vertical and in a relaxed manner. Throw it and <laughs> throw it forward and slightly upward, imparting and spinning motion to it as it leaves the hand. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, dude, it's gonna get him! Turns out, throwing a boomerang way harder than it looks and it gets you way more drunk. Who knew? Um, I lost it, so that's cool. And it's now dark, so that's gonna be sacrificed to the Australian gods. Yeah, down under. That was an expensive boomerang too. Was it the boomerang 9000? Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah. 9000 and one. You gotta be really skilled to make that thing come back and neither of us could do it, so. I guess I'm just as Aussie as you are. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I'm Officer Dan and I'm in Australia. He is, but he's dressed wrong. He's just not Aussie enough. He is, but let's fix a few things. Yeah, John, what the fuck is that? You're like, <laughs> like, you like pouting for walking that. away. Why are you pulling faces? <laughs> You've never done this before, have you? Hey, I'm Officer Dan, and I'm in Australia. He is in Australia. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this is Officer Dan, and I'm in Australia. He is in Australia, but what he's wearing is not working. His pants are too long, they're too bright, mine are short, like a tiger. We need to change that. <laughs> Just a <laughs> Where are you going with this? <laughs> hey, it's Officer Dan and I'm in Australia. 
No. That's cool, Seriously. mate. Seriously. Hey, I'm Officer Dan, and I'm in Australia. <laughs> <laughs> My yeah. channel. We're like just gonna do. We're just gonna do one that says. I'm in Australia. Australia. That can be yours. Oh. We have a lot of time, so we're fine. All right. Sorry. <laughs> what else? That's it. And then what? So you look hungry? So then I'm like. So now you're like, yeah, better. <laughs> what? Who hired this guy? Slightly high. <laughs> Vegemite. He also looks thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> now that I'm feeling fully awkward, I want to learn how to throw a boomerang. Yeah, that's fine, but we got to get you set up. Thanks, but we're not doing the boomerang first. Yeah, we're doing the Vegemite and the beer first. Oh now, he's ready to throw a boomerang. <laughs> oh my god. No! Oh. Jesus! Wow. Dude! You are almost there. He's almost there. You've got this. Up here. Oh, that's Sandy. I got that? your pen. <laughs> 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 